yeast. We got some yeast. Uh, we're gonna we have to activate it. So how do you activate the yeast? I'm so glad you asked. Can you do like a wake like? We're gonna get some water in. Yeah. But it's really important that it's like kind of warm. That feels kind of warm to me. No, it doesn't feel warm enough actually. Uh, what would be your temperature if you were actually gonna? 110, 115. So above your body temperature. Yeah, definitely. Cool. <laughs> this is the song. Wake up everybody. From this point, just sprinkle a little sugar on it. So you just sprinkle sugar on the yeast and it wakes up? Yeah, it's gonna wake up. It's like. Oh, it's funny, it's the same thing with me. Good morning, sweeties. Oh, we're just gonna do a little one of these. Good. Like you gotta kind of look at the expiration date because sometimes you, it might not. You're moving around too much. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. You're still moving around too much. It might not there activate. You so you gotta check the date. Check the date so it activates. Hey! This is what gets you Grammys, people. Yeah, it's true. It's true. We're gonna do one spell flower, one all purpose flower, and then we're gonna combine them together and do half and half. It says to sift it. Nobody has time. Nobody, nobody Does has anyone even sift. own like, a sifter? Do you remember the last time I sifted flour? Home economics class in eighth grade. That's like half, maybe. We'll just fill the other part with sifting. A wonderful sifting job. <laughs> My favorite video from home economics class was like, you should sift your flowers because then your dishes will be nice and fluffy. And it's like this woman holds up this like beautifully decorated cake and it's like, it's like, and if you don't sift your flowers, it'll be like, and it's just like this brick of cake. And then it's like, well, it tosses cake to the ground, glass breaking sound effect. It looks like our, our yeast is getting activated. You want to see a little bit of foam. It looks like a latte. Soy milk latte. It's definitely activated. You can tell because of all the bubbles. That's going to be what makes it all fluffy. Each one is going to get two teaspoons of oh. butter. Make sure you get an action shot. This is like a melon baller? I use it to scoop cookies. Oh my gosh, you are such a baller. <laughs> you butter not be joking. Butter, butter not, butter not squat. Oh my god. Oh, do the, do the guy, the guy. Salfe. Salfe. <laughs> Next step, one teaspoon of sugar in each. Is this vegan sugar we're working with? <laughs> you can't trick me. No, like there is non-vegan sugar. It's Wait, just the, it's the, it's the stop what's wrong with sugar. this sugar? This is stop and chop sugar. I have no idea. It might not be vegan. It's okay. Just use your vegan sugar when you're cooking this at home. I'm foregoing this right now. Isn't it weird? There's like how much sugar's in this? There's sugar in a, in the savory pretzels. You're gonna mm. add this to yes. each one and beat it for three minutes. Beat it! Beat it! Beat it! Beat it. it smells like beer. It does, but beer. it smells like beer in the way that like this bathroom smells like beer. It smells like beer. You know, I'm just thinking we should just use glasses. As much glass as possible. And, okay. Okay, I see. So just like put and then get these even. And then... I mean, they're all kind of yeah. even. Good okay. Enough. And we just beat these. You beat it for three minutes. <laughs> Let's take a moment to appreciate the differences between these three. Pretty traditional. This is a flour mixture. This is the straight spelt, and this is the mix, which is really interesting because this looks like an in-between of those two. Uh, That's what happens don't measure things. So now it's been at least three minutes, right? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got some air bubbles happening here. Ooh. Ooh, activated. Why'd you have to go and make things so, so activated? activated. I want to go to karaoke after this. Is there a karaoke bar in Bridgeport? No, there's a German restaurant. So okay, let's... that's not like a close second. This looks like a living uh, thing. I saw Venom recently and that's what this reminds me of. Ah, okay, go. how many? Three and one third ounces. So it's a little over three ounces. A little what are we doing there? Is that too much? Uh, just all in at once? Yep. Alright, and that's gonna be kneaded until it loses its stickiness. Maybe we have a kneading space. I need space. you to need me. <laughs> I've definitely sung that before on this show. So Tess, what's this gonna get, take to convert you to a full vegan? I don't know. I feel like I'm too lazy. People ask me why I'm vegetarian and they're like, is it because of the animals? I'm like, well, I'd be a hypocrite because I'm not vegan, so I can't say that. And then like, is it for health reasons? I'm like, well, I don't eat healthy all the time, so can't say that. <laughs> like the little asterisks on the end of like every veganism definition, the one that I like is like within reason. You know, you do it as, you know, what works for you. And how are we going to get you to vegetarianism? I, mean, I love how I say all this stuff about like, everyone do their own thing. I'm like, so what's, uh... I mean, how do we change you? you? So they're supposed to be in a greased Grease bowl. bowl. Grease cover and until they're twice their size. Okay, should I just... Yes, go for it. Oh, yeah, hey, whatever. We're all friends here. Ta-da! Look at this, it's like... It's so different. It's like a grayscale. I'm not gonna give up side shot 
Uh, I'm not gonna give up. The whole video is gonna be silent. Let rise in a covered bowl until doubled in bulk. So now we have risen in order of appearance. This one looks like it has the best sort of. Can you see those air bubbles in there? I can. This one has some nice things going on too. It's kind of dense. <laughs> Four cups of water, it says. Because we kind of want it to be able to float in there. We're not oh. using an alum aluminum pan for this mixture. What other options? What are other options? We don't Test have iron? Some. Maybe. Everybody needs one of these too. She's showing off how much <laughs> she has in her kitchen. <laughs> I could probably use a lot less. And four. Uh, this looks better. And we need five of these thingies. Make sure you sift it. Two. How many? That's three. Five. Need five. Four. Four. Five. Four. Five. 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 Oh man. It used to be boiling. Maybe a whisk would be better. So whisk it. Whisk it, whisk it real good. It's really whisky, but... Ooh, really whiskey. whiskey. Okay, so then we're gonna boil them for a little bit. This is gonna give that outer texture. Of, Wait, so you boil it the and pencil. then you bake it. I think that's what the instructions say. Test, permanent. I mean, this will, that tastes like a pretzel. Taste this. Just, just put your, yeah. Then that tastes like a pretzel? Yes. You, why make pretzels when you could just make pretzel you water? Can just, you could just lick baking soda. Wait, let's make the shapes. Punch, divide, okay. conquer. Punch, divide, conquer. Punch down. Punch, punch down. Oh yeah, look at that, deflated. We want it deflated like- Deflated like my ego. And then I divide it into three. Punch it. Four. We actually like punch it? Four, four. Just punch down on it. Everyone wants a knife. Ooh, I'll take a knife. All right, we have punchage. And, and then what four. happens? We have to shape it and then boil it. Oh, that's a good technique test. Yeah. You see me rolling. Ra oh, I need I need the towel underneath. It's gonna get me rad and dirty. I actually just know the Weird Al version of that song. You grab them. You spin them. Oh, have you ever been to that place in uh, New York called Handful Doodle? Mm -hmm. You can see them in the back like whipping noodles like woo! They, you so flip it, twist it, and, and pretzel it. Pretzel it. That's a lot smaller that's than I thought it was gonna adorable. be. adorable. Yeah, <laughs> that looks perfect. There it is. <laughs> Yes. Now twist it, twist this, and then there you go. Twist it, you twist it, and you pretzel it. Twist it, pretzel it. This looks so nice. Look at the technique. <laughs> like, just compare. I <laughs> look like piles of uh, doo doo. How long do you boil them for? One minute, or until they float to the top. <laughs> So this, what is actually happening here? It's, it's like making nice things happen on the outside. Yeah, flip them over. Look how puffy my pretzels are. That's looking good. So I should take these out? Yeah. yeah. Oh. It's reacting. Science! So we have some coarse sea salt. So we're just going to do one of these thingies. Just kind of let it pick up wherever it catches. The going into the oven shot. Woo! Pretzels! Ta-da! Oh, damn. These look so good. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so soft. <gasps> oh my gosh. Here, take this before you, you eat someone's face. Screen grab. This is going to be a... Uh, hold on. We'll get the dog in the shot. Stanley. Oh. oh. <laughs> Stanley, you were looking at the right spot for just a moment. Stanley. Okay, I'll, I'll be able to sneak something out of there. I thought it was going to be dry, but it's a lot... Um, not dry? Not dry. Oh, it's a very kind oh. half and half. Uh, it's more chewy. Understandably, more gluten. I'm going to go with regular pretzel, the most chewy, most doughy, very traditional. Boom. Oh, and look at that, that melty butter. What a good look. Tasty. That was awesome. That was really Dreamwork makes that dream work. Thanks for inviting me into your larger omnivorous kitchen. <laughs> yeah, um, I have something for you that Tess and I made. It is a jar of apple pie moonshine. It is really strong. So, okay, I will um, drink it carefully. Be careful with that. It's All right, there it is. has apple pie, apple cider, apple juice, cinnamon, like cinnamon sticks. So you see it has this one in, in it. it. Yep, that's a cinnamon yeah, stick. Yeah. Grain alcohol. Then we usually put Few shots of um, fireball. fireball in it. Ooh, would and you recommend mixing this or something or just having it slowly straight? I would actually recommend waiting a week or two before yeah, drinking so it. Can... It gets better after at least a week. Okay, it's like and chili. And then you can drink it over ice. It's drink good it by itself. Up. It's not like drinking a shot. You can also mix it with apple cider. Oh, okay, cool, cool. This is tanky on the top. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> Friendship forever. Yay!